Hello, hello everyone! Welcome to the next episode of Irish Diaries. I would love to show you something very unique and very Irish authentic. I'm hiking up the hill to show you this marvelous sight. I'm heading over to Ballincolly Castle. Stay with me if you want to see it as well. So, what fascinates me the most is that the cows are grazing just next to the castle. This is just an abandoned ancient ruin and it looks so mystic to me. This is how I always imagine Ireland with, it, with lots of castles, some abandoned ruins here and there. And yeah, um, so you can have a look at uh, you can have a look at it with me and let's go. Balincoli Castle looks totally mystic. It's a decent place to visit if you like history. It is interesting to observe the construction and design of this medieval monument and how it bravely withstood the pressure of many years and still stands the test of time. The castle itself is basically a tower with three floors and it dates back to the 13th century. Balincolic Castle was built after the Norman invasion of Ireland and uh, it's located to the south of the town of Balincolic. And uh, I marvel to see cows grazing just next to it. That's exactly where heavenly, heavenly dreary gold is produced in these very special places. <laughs> further down the streets. Here you can see how wealthy people live in Ireland. Yeah, this mansion, I really like it. It's so huge. Look at this vast area around it. And yeah, that's again where I get my inspiration every time I stroll through the streets and um, just marvel at these huge mansions. Yeah, that's how Irish live here on the outskirts in the surrounding area of Balincolic. This lovely area and located just across the road um, from the Balincolic castle this lovely area I call the Danish area because it reminds me um, of Danish architecture. Look, look at this wood and also, you know, the doors and the house is, has lots of wood. Normally, I, I wouldn't say that in Ireland um, they put wood uh, on the outside of the house. Well, not not that much, at least. And this particular area really uh, drew my attention because it has this unique um, architectural style and um, I love these wooden windows, wooden framed windows, I love how much greenery surrounds the area and um, it overlooks the uh, fir tree forest and also the Balincolic castle. I would love to live in one of those houses. Mm -hmm. 